So there was a viral video uh, that went on YouTube. Uh, you and another rapper, y'all were in the studio. Mm -hmm. Whatever broke out, it broke out. You don't got to speak on it. I'm just asking because it's it was everywhere when it happened. Mm -hmm. uh, you know, I, I, different stories that bloggers reported on and shit like that. Um, you know, uh, if you want to talk about it, we can. But it looked like it was three or four guys approaching you in the studio. It looked like you were by yourself. I really approached them, but I approached them, but it really, that shit don't matter for real, for real. You know what happened. They know what happened. I know what happened. Um, everybody can say what, what they want about it. I approached them. I don't be thinking about, I know everybody think about jury and shit like that. I don't think about that shit when I get mad. That shit materialistic. So when I get mad, I just black out. So that just is what it is. It, they got off. It is what it is. I would have did the same thing to me, for real, for real. I would have did the same thing to me if I approached me like I approached them. So it is what it is. It's six on one. Man, you got a lot of balls, man, in the studio. You, I mean, <laughs> you approach six guys? Nigga, if I see somebody, just like I just addressed that, I'm going to address it. Yeah, I respect it. No matter what, how many people you with, I don't really be thinking about that type of stuff. I know what my name hold out here. A nigga know what's gonna happen if you play with me. So that just is what it is. I ain't even. I'm not the toughest man in the world or nothing. It's just something I stand on. I stand on my own principles. I stand on tall business, and that just is what it is. So if I see Sean Cotton, or if I see Suave, or if I see Sada Baby, if I see anybody that I feel like I have an issue, I'm gonna try to talk it out. I'm gonna try to talk that out, and if it escalate from there, it just escalate from there. But I gotta, I gotta know. I, I'm not gonna be out here like wondering if Sean Cotton got a problem with me. I'm gonna yeah. ask Sean Cotton, and I'm not gonna be on Instagram trying to ask Sean Cotton and none of that. I'm a, just like I wasn't gonna keep DMing you and try to bug you about that. I was gonna wait till I seen you, cause money never yeah. the issue. I know money not no issue for you. You don't got to scam people. Money not an issue for me. I'm not even worried about that. I just don't, I don't want nobody to feel like they could get off on me. Right. You feel me? So with that studio shit, it just is what it is. When I get into it with a person, I don't think like, let me tuck my jewelry. I'm not, I didn't think that. I don't really care about it. It's materialistic. I got hundreds of thousands. I really don't, I could get that shit again. I wouldn't really think about that shit. I was really irritated. Like, you could tell I was irritated when you seen the video. I was really irritated. Mm. They didn't walk up on me. I walked up on them. That just re is what it is. All that other shit went how it went. I can't speak on that, but it is what it is. They didn't walk up on me. They did what they were supposed to do. I walked up on them, for sure. They did what they were supposed to do. I don't fault them yeah. for that. Whatever, whichever way it go is which way it go. They did what they were supposed to do. If a nigga walk up on me, I'm supposed to do something to him, for sure, if we get into it. So I ain't taking nothing away from them. They did what they did. I wouldn't did all the internet shit. That's what I don't like, all the internet shit. I wouldn't do it. I'm, I ain't going back and forth on the internet. But they did what they were supposed to do. Like, yeah. I don't care. I'm My my life an open book, Sean Cotton. You can ask me about anything. I'm not embarrassed about nothing or nothing. It is what it is. A nigga know what I stand for out here in these Detroit streets. I don't know how a nigga feel about me all the way out of town, none of that shit. I don't really hang with out of towners. Here, niggas know what I stand for. Even them, they know what I stand for. So, like I said, they did what they were supposed to do, period. I don't fault them for none of that. Yeah. I, I recently heard you say you don't even want the chain back. Why would I? I don't want nothing that a nigga took from me. I don't want nothing that a nigga took from me. You already posted on the internet and all that shit. I don't want nothing that a nigga took from me. It's good. It is what it is. Yeah. They, and like, that shit sold anyway. For real, for real. What you gonna do with it? You can't wear it. 